Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks a lot for showing up today. Really appreciate it. Jibe here. Today we're going to be watching some Twisted Fate in Arena of Valor X Pro. Let's get into it. Not wasting any time. Let's go right now. Twisted Fate is who we're going to be watching today. Mid laner. Super interested to see how this one goes today. So if you think you're going to play Wild Rift, you're in the right place. If you think you're going to watch Wild Rift, you're in the right place. If you just want to learn a little bit more about Wild Rift, you're in the right place. Anything Wild Rift, you're in the right place. So any questions you guys have about the game, about champions, please, please, please comment below. Would love to help you guys answer any of the questions you have. And yeah, that's that. So don't be afraid to comment down below. Message me on Twitter, DM me on Discord, join the Discord, whatever you want. I'm here, I'll answer. Let's get it going. Starting off slow here, gonna face Oriana. Super interesting to see how this matchup's gonna go. Wow, Twisted Fate getting some damage. Looks like it was an even trade. Even trade there. No harm, no foul, they say. So we just watched Fizz yesterday. Or you guys watched Fizz yesterday. So another mid laner. Definitely, I guess mid lane's a popular position. We watched Yasio. We got all kind of mid laners. So definitely, I used to play, I used to play Lux a lot. Used to main her if you know who she is. Very, very fun mid laner. I loved her. Loved her. The sad part is there's better champions. So we're going to watch Twisted Fate here. You see how he picks a, he is a deck of cards. He picks a card. Each card has a different ability. And you never know what's coming until it shows up. So you got to have fast reaction to play him. Also, we're going to see his ultimate, which is unique to him. It makes him teleport into location. And it shows the enemy where he's going to teleport. We'll see that. Super cool. Super cool. You know, they really did, as you can see, goes into the bush. Good job. Got a little Facebook message there. Sadly, I can't make content myself. Really, really wish I could. But we got to record over YouTube videos and talk after. That's just how it is for now. You wait, though. I'm going to have the best content you've ever seen when the game comes out. We're going to be number one in those leaderboards. You better believe it. Better believe it. Nice shot by him there. Getting a little damage on her. So actually, we're down. His team's down 0 to 2. Usually, the person we watch dominates, wins every game. But right now, we're down 0 to 2. As you can see, Grave showing himself. So Jungle shows himself mid. Most most of the times, your team sees it. If not, you always want to call it out. Just simple. There you go. Oh, hits a stun. Ooh. Has flash. Good, good no flash. I don't think he could have got it. So good, good, good no waste there. Good job. So if you see a jungle go from top to bottom jungle, you just simply want to call out Graves because everyone, if if you're playing, you should know who's where. Did you see Graves is coming? There you go. Graves is coming. Oriana really wants to go. He's going to flash on her if he needs to. Doesn't even need to. He said, get back to base. He's going in. He's probably going to die. Then he uses flash. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> he gets away. Wow. What a play. This guy's good. We knew it when he played Fizz. When we watched him play Fizz. And now he's dominating already with Twisted Fate. Four minutes into this game. Already dominating. Two to nothing. Beautiful. Two kills, no deaths. It's beautiful. So, again, going back to what I was saying, Graves, you see him go from top to bot. You just want to call out to your team, hey, Graves, quote unquote, the jungle. Here's the ult. Here's the ult. Wow. Oh, 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 my God. This is exciting. That was a thing of beauty. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He's about to go in again. Has no mana. No mana left. No man alive. Not, nothing he can do now. 
he's probably gonna let it let it rebuild or go back to base and get some more mana or he can get one of the fruits and get get some mana back wow that was exciting just that's what you call taking over the game this guy's a this guy's a game changer they call him showtime <laughs> i love that showtime so going back to graves crossing the middle you really want to call out that to your team top to bottom jungle graves is going top to bottom jungle so your team hears that so that means top can relax if he sees mid in the lane if he sees mid and mid lane and two bottom and he know graves is bottom that means he has no chance to get ganked at that moment so it really just helps your team out and then that help that means bottom should play a little bit more conservative you know not push as far up really just yeah be prepared that the the jungle is bottom and they may be coming for him as you can see <laughs> twisted fate takes first tower not a problem very 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 easy i mean we're watching art right here this is just beautiful is what we're watching a thing of beauty probably gonna go to a different lane here all is up for him we'll see how he uses it though what do you want to do stay in mid i think he's just gonna keep farming up so we will see that gold you're gonna get stronger and stronger more items take over the game he has four to six kills for his team what, what more do you want i really really like watching this guy play super good super smart super patient which is probably the most important thing so we'll see we'll keep an eye about how he plays how patient he is what he does how he does it so he's got everything up He's got flash, he's got barrier, he's got alt, he's got the whole nine yards up. Let's see where everyone's at. Okay, so everyone's bottom. You see three are there. I believe they're taking dragon. Oh, they got the rift. Didn't realize it was that early in the game. Good call by them. Jax is solo top. Jax is might get killed. As you can see, Camille's up top. So we'll see how that goes. Mm. Alted there. See how this turns out. I mean, look at the damage. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I mean, it's like, it's like stealing the candy from a baby. Too easy. Oh my goodness. This game's over already. Six kills. No deaths. No assists. Six out of nine kills for, for his team. This guy's too good. Let's just say I'm glad this guy's not an NA. We'll say that. Because he's a beast. I mean, you can tell. I mean, X, X Arena Valor player. Just dominating. I think you're going to see a lot of that. A lot of the Vainglory players that I know. And AOV players that I know. Obviously. Going to be switching to Wild Rift. It's going to be the new game. Those games are going to die. This game's going to take over. Probably going to be one of the biggest titles in mobile. Of all time. That's my prediction at least. That's just my personal prediction. Let me know what you guys think. If you think it's going to be the biggest game in mobile history. Please let me know. I really do. Just because of the popularity. Oh my god he's godlike. He's godlike. He's almost at a kill a minute. He's about to be at a kill a minute. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. We're going to hit a replay here just to witness the greatness. As you can see, he hits the, the freeze for a couple seconds. Just a thing of beauty. Perfect timing on that. Perfect timing. I mean, what more? What more can you ask? You can't ask anything more of this guy.
He's playing like an all-star. The all-star he is. Beautiful. Beautiful. Eight kills. Nine minutes. I mean, what do you want? This guy's experienced. He knows what he's doing. And he came to play. So, curious to see how good AOV players are going to be. And Vainglory, Vainglory players are going to be. Obviously, you know, they, they have the experience in MOBAs. Here we go. <laughs> it's literally too easy. He's one-shotting them without a problem. And they got four top. You might as well say goodbye right now. Who's ever, whoever wants to come challenge them, it's going to be GG back to the lobby. I mean, seriously, this, this game's over. I mean, Twisted Fate took it over single-handedly. Simple as that. Greatness. Greatness. He's hungry. He's calling for he's calling for a Baron Nasher here. I don't know if his team's gonna listen. If I was playing with him, I, I would quite frankly do anything the guy asked. I mean, usually the people that are carrying get to make the calls. Even if it's even if you play bad one game and nobody listens to you the next game, if you come out, you're eight no, people are gonna listen to you. That's just how it is. That's just really how it is. Hits the flash in. Blitzcrank hits him. He gets help from his team. Legendary. What do you know? Surprise, surprise. I'm not surprised at all. I wouldn't be surprised if they end right here. Oh my god. I was watching the clip with my friends today where he says, Oh my god. He on X Games, bro. It's so funny. I love that clip. So, so funny. And that's it. <laughs> what do you want me to say? Just dominance. What we just witnessed was greatness. Phenomenal gameplay. Again. That's what you get when you get you know, X AOV players. X Mangori players. So we'll see how that goes. We're going to keep an update. We're going to keep an eye on all of these X pro players and see how good they do in Wild Rift. Because it is a different game. Granted, very similar. But that is all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Watching. You guys are the best. Appreciate every single one of you. Thank you so much. We will see you tomorrow. Back at it again with another Wild Rift video. Every day. All day. 365 days a year. Alright. Peace.